Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4, Kaiserreich as Austria. Let us continue on from where we last left off. You think I can kill this unit and get these three divisions to be completely encircled? Because if Venice can end up winning the war in Italy, I'm assuming they can... Can they join our faction? I don't actually know. Okay, we have some Venetian support over here. They're at 60%. Because we can encircle these. I mean, I guess they wouldn't technically be encircled because they're bordering us. Even though we're hostile to their government. We hate them, by the way. Outrage minus 100. Yeah, we despise them with all of our being. Okay, now they put an extra unit here. That's going to be uh, a little bit more complicated. Well, let's see if we can maybe, like, support you. Oh, what are they mountains? Marsh. Plains. I mean, they're not terrible areas for us to take. You know, let's actually have tw uh, 20 rows of you. Do we have tanks? We have 352 light tanks. If I was to throw, let's just say, two more tank divisions in here, we won't have enough tanks for this, but I'm fine upgrading these guys for now. Will I actually ever be able to support Venice? Again, it, it just gave a vague, um, we'll, we'll sign you guys to Red Army. It, it just gave a vague, um, in a few months we can support the, the, the Venetians. I don't know when that can happen. Again, assuming it actually can, and they're not just expecting you to die immediately. Well, I mean, if they lose Venice, of course, like, then it's over. But if we can hold on... Hey! Intervention in Italy! It has become increasingly clear that ANI cannot control the situation in Italy. Uh, though neither can a Venetian revolt get the upper hand. If we were to consider intervening, now would be the time to do it. Though with an eye towards destroying power of the Italian Federation under Hasbro Ked, and not towards destroying the failed Italian Republic. Of course, it would require a Venetian agreement, but surely they would not refuse our help. Absolutely, I will offer support to the Venetians. Oh wait, am I at war now? Oh, I am at war. Okay, well, you're just going to march your way straight in. You're going to go here. You guys are going to go here. You're just going to go straight to Milan, and two of you are going to go here. So the Venetians have agreed. The Social Republic has uh, rejected our uh, reactor intervention. Now the Italian war is launched. Of, uh, hey! Oh, no, they're invading into Legionnaire Italy. Okay, I thought they were attacking us. Because I'm pretty sure that would be a trigger for the second... Well, not the second Vilkri, but to uh, a French... For them joining the, um, the war. If I can take Milan, though, before the, uh, before the socialists can do anything, which we should be able to, they have collapsed. We're not at war with the SRI. We're not, I mean, sure, if you want to join the war, it's not a big deal. Uh, get rid of this. Bring our units right over here. This doesn't work. Fantastic. So we are going to demand these two states. Confirm an exit. Yeah, so you're you're not in my faction. So I'm not too ex sure exactly how this is going to work out, but I mean it worked pr pretty well. Uh we took over the Italian Republic. We have denied the socialist a foot or more of a foothold. So we're always happy to see that. Like, it says that you're blue. I know that's because we sent you volunteers. I guess we'll recall the volunteers from you. Okay, we embrace, uh, embrace pluralism. Nations in a state. I want to rush away straight down to uh, the Nubian Federation as quickly as we possibly can. Uh, Next up, I think I want to put five into tank production, please. The fate of Lombardy. Give them to Venice. I guess we'll bring our units out of Venice for now. You've arrived in Trees. Bring you into Brown Army. What about Frilly? Will Frilly go back to uh, Venice as well? I don't know. Like I don't know what they can do. Because they're considered our, our ally. They like us. Close allies plus one hundred. Can they reform the, uh, the Italian Federation? 
Will we be getting a vent about it? Aircraft design or industrial... Do I want any of these things? You know what? Let's save up to 200 political power so we can get our, uh, we can get our military genius. So again, we have this state from you. Hey, Venice. I don't know what, they, what they're what they really up to. France declared war on Tunisia. Not a, not a big deal for us. Okay, build military factories in lower uh, Austria, in upper Austria. Because we don't have an option here to, like, make them our ally. Which is very, very sad. Uh, artillery, do I care about any of you? I don't think so. Industry. You're about a year ahead of time. Do I want to spend that now? How long? In yeah, give me the 39 industry. We have so many. Again, we have five research slots, which is, like, really good. We, we can't afford it. And, I mean, I guess Venice does have a claim here. Should I have given all of this to Venice? I guess what I can do is just uh, state management. Mark this state and then just give it to you. I'm like, maybe this is why they weren't doing it. They have declared war on the Qing. Like, can they release Milan? I don't really know what Venice can do. Holland's has dissolved... Uh, some stuff in Ireland. Okay, what? Okay, 200. Which means we can get our army maneuver. We, our units now move at lightning speed. Romania is just fighting a war again. Already? Romania? I guess I'll bring this army down south. Towards the Romanian border. I don't know if they're going to really declare war right away, but we'll see. Okay, our IMRO has been annexed. That is completely A-OK -okay for us. And Nezhen Han has been annexed. A string of disappearances. Within a short time frame, several officials of the Ministry of Defense and Army have either vanished or turned up dead. Assassinated by an unknown assailant. Whether a private individual or a foreign government hostile wars, only one testimony has been given us any sort of lead. And it claims that they witnessed Mustafa Gubalik, a legendary assassin who vanished during the interwar period and was presumed dead. Uh, it has since been dismissed as entirely unlikely. Okay. Very interesting, in indeed. Okay, nation within a state. We have federalized, which means that all of our units does not have the spirit of rethinking our administration. Do I need to get all the way down here to do this? I mean, you give us some bonuses. Or do you just, like, last a... You last until... You last until 38. Okay, you last longer than I thought, so I guess we'll uh, get our industry tax then. But it should mean that, I think, Bohemia, Galicia, Lemuria, Slovakia is accepted. I mean, it should be everybody other than, um... Do I not get... Wait, do I not get their soldiers? I really thought that I would, uh... Did I at least get their... I at least got their equipment. So that's nice. But I also, I really thought I got their units as well. Um, put up to 19 for the time being. <laughs> okay. So it's not as good as I thought. Has it always been the case that they, um, I, I could have sworn that they used to inherit all of their units. Maybe, maybe there's like a time on that. I don't know. Like, maybe they'll all just spawn in Vienna in a, in a second. Military integration. Training time. Okay, so, in, so we just get a really strong bonus to training more units. I mean, I guess that works out fine for us. The units will train faster. It works out a-okay. World tension at 41. So not enough for us to... Um... Yeah, so get two of you. Put a five on this. Give me five on fighters as well. Everything else looking okay. Do I have enough artillery to throw in support equipment on this? Yes. 
We'll get that accomplished now as well. Find you with the red army. I would like to train at least a couple of more tanks as well. Go up to like five on that. For the time being. Venice, are you not supposed to join my faction? It really feels like that's one of those things that you should uh, you should be doing. Is joining up with our faction. Or at least like release in Milan. Usually that's one of the... Uh, I mean, does Venice have a focus tree? They do. Open the Great Council, New Republic, Old Republic. Aristocratic Republic. May uh, be used to join decisions. Or join factions. So maybe we just need to uh, wait long enough and they'll join us. Iberia joining International, not a big surprise. Portugal's not in a, in a faction yet, but at this point I would... Probably end up joining the Entente or something like that. But hey, that's just me. And I'm not, I'm not a I'm not a foreign policy expert. The Slovenes are one of the lesser talk about minorities in their empire. Uh, though that after hundreds of years of being a part of it, they're stuck to their own language and culture. The newest bestseller in the Slovene speaking territory is written by Batral is the story of a Turkish and Persian struggle and cruel the fortress of Amblut. The action is set in the eleventh century when Seljuk Turks started expanding into Asia Minor. It's also, it is suspected that the book will be translated into German and various other languages soon enough. Well, thank you. Can I just assign you to... Uh, do I want to... Who do I assign you? I guess I don't assign you to anybody right now. Oh, somebody, do I have enough tanks for this? Oh, we're only missing 363, which is not too much. It'll be done in 100 days. Honestly, completely reasonable. Um, what else do you want to build? Medium airframe. Sure, let's get five more of you. Got six more divisions. You know, let's start just preparing another army. Uh, we're going to assign you to be the yellow army. I mean, actually, that's that's a little bit too close to, like, the uh, brownish there. So go purple army. We'll put you on the border of Venice for now. Just because I don't really know where else to put you. Yeah, World Tank has 43. It's not high enough. I want I want to go up higher... So that I can invite more people into my faction. Because Greece, they're still in the Belgrade Pact. At some point, they should give up. You're authoritarian democratic. More than 600 tension. Has completed Greater Bulgaria Memorials. Is not authoritarian democratic. So, I guess... Is Bulgaria... Is, um... Why is authoritarian, authoritarian democratic opposed to joining up with Austria? That's what I want to know. I mean, so it's a national catastrophe. Oh, no, I guess they can do this one. Yeah, if they do greater uh, Bulgarian memorials, then we can invite them into our faction. And again, at some point, I would love to do that. Serbia is now just fighting war. Are they going to do, like, the actual war war? Because if that's the case, you know what, Purple Army, I, I, you know, we, we had some good times in the past. I need you to be here, and you're going to drive your way straight down to Serbia. Are they going to declare war on us? They don't, they don't, like, they usually don't do it until, um... Actually, are you all cores? You are all cores. Oh, beautiful. You know, don't even build factory sale, but then build them all in Prague, because that's where we get our best bonuses. We can build some over in Krakow as well. And you know what? Deploy these 15 units. Or, well, 6 units. Because I think we need them on the field sooner rather than later. We don't have enough. You know what we should actually We should build more trucks. You know what? Give me straight up on 10 uh, truck production on this. Okay, decentralization. And, again, we can't go down further on this tree until... December of this year. Which should be enough time, yeah, for us to at least... If not complete this, get through most of the, um, get through most of the, 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 the juice. The fucking juice. What the hell am I talking about? Get through the, um, focuses down here. <laughs> also apparently known as the juice. Again, Venice should be friendly with us. I can't guarantee their independence. I also, I really find it annoying, Kaiser, that you can only guarantee the independence of, like, 
other countries have the exact same ideology. It should be based on ideology, like ideology groups. Maybe they just can't, maybe they can't do that. I don't know. Theorist, victory or power, strategic destruction. I don't think I want any of this stuff. Do we have any good like high command, cavalry attack, eight percent less attrition? I mean that's not bad. We got a genius strategic bomber. Plus nine percent. You know, infantry expert. Always, always happy to have infantry expert. I guess all of you probably should also have some commands. You guys move your way into Romania. Red Army, you're going to move your way into Serbia. I, I, Greece, you don't need to join this war. Again, assuming that they actually are going to be going to war. You don't need to do it. You can very easily just stay out of this. We have, 40, have 42,000 rifles. I should just be, like, fucking pumping a massive army. If anything, actually, I should also wait until we can get ourselves up to extend the conscription. Which, if Serbia were to declare war on us, we should be able to do pretty easily. Pants and nails ambitions. I mean, Romania is still rather undefended. If I can put, like, an army right in the middle of Romania, we could probably split them in half. I mean, you know what? Yeah. I'm going to put an army right in these two provinces. Their job is just to move really straight to Bucharest. Cut Romania basically off from the, Vesta, the rest of the um, Belgrade Pact. If they want to go to war, my fucking god, we'll go to war. Uh, deploy more planes. Fantastic. And everybody should be doing uh, one of these two. So I need all over the Red Army. Increase in separatist activity. It's come to our. Uh, I guess yeah. Transylvania joins Romania immediately if they um, if they revolt against us, right? I forgot about that. It has come to our attention that the Romanian government has started to, uh, discreetly supplying Transylvania separatist movements with arms and funding. While the legionary government officially denies this, there is no surprise. The propaganda has called for conflict with Transylvania for years now. Our border guards and police are well equipped to handle these recent events. But we should be wary nonetheless. The madman behind the Carpathians is surely plotting our demise. Resistance over here has been enabled. Do you know what? Okay, I'm going to reposition these guys again. To literally just be in this single province. And then push one of these two provinces depending on where we need to actually get it done. It does worry me a little bit. Because I don't want my territory to revolt against us. Who, who's actually doing occupation right now? I'm going to duplicate you. I'm going to replace you all with armored cars. I don't think we have military police right now. Who actually boosts suppression? If I remove you, suppression still at 7.5. Again, you're not going to be going to war with anybody, so we just get rid of the suppression here. Yeah, save that up. And now... Our copy, yeah, 200. It's a little expensive at 96. Do we have enough... Sub do we actually have enough uh, armored cars for that? Right, and we're missing 500. So the answer right now is no. Do you know what? Let's just throw in... I guess we'll throw in some cavalry as well. Uh, not artillery pieces. Maybe a bit overkill. I mean, how much suppression? You have suppression of two. I mean, it's actually, it's only two versus 2.5. It's not that much better, but it does increase. I'm assuming the hardness is way better. Hardness of zero, hardness of also zero. <laughs> anyway, so we'll, we'll save this up. It seems okay. But I think for now, this is going to be a good time for us to end this episode. Thank you, everybody, for watching. My name is Anthem. If you enjoyed... Remember to thumbs up, not to click something down. If you want to see more, subscribe and goodbye.